you. Interesting. The side mission Sublevel 13 in Borderlands the Pre-Sequel has many references to the characters, creators, and elements from the film Ghostbusters. There may be slight spoilers for the story, so take this as your spoiler warning. In the mission, Pickle sends you to find his friend Harry. When you find him, he has a modified laser weapon called E-Gun. Good old Harry, always the joker. The name Harry is likely a nod to actor Harold Ramis, who co-wrote and starred in Ghostbusters. The name of his weapon, E-Gun, sounds similar to the name of Ramis's character Egon. When looking at the designs on E-Gun, there is a nose symbol painted on the side. The no symbol is a prominent feature of the Ghostbusters logo. E-Gun shoots a continuous laser beam that damages ghosts. This is similar to the proton stream that is fired from the Ghostbusters proton pack. During gameplay, E-Gun will say, Are you experiencing feelings of dread? Harold Ramis' character says the same line in the film for the commercial the Ghostbusters produced for television. Feelings of dread in your basement or attic? Locked door, eh? Wait a minute. I've got some old doll security codes around here somewhere. Here we go. Try inputting one, nine, eight, four. The code to open the locked door, 1984 or 1984 was the same year the Ghostbusters film was released in theaters. By finishing the sub-level 13 mission with four characters in your party, you are awarded the achievement, Who You Gonna Call? Having four people in the group is referencing the Ghostbusters as there were four members on the team. And of course, the title of the achievement is a lyric from the Ghostbusters theme song. Continuous laser beam that looks just like the one from that movie, Ghost Dad!